Hi friends, today we are going to talk about what is the actual technical object behind a theory. So how will you know whether a theory is installed or not? Is you go to this transaction slash UI2 slash FLP and if you double click on it, it will open this, this transaction code. So I am just showing because it takes a lot of time to open this for me. That's why I didn't want to click. So once you double click on it, it will open the Fury app. So now what I want to know is what is the app behind this? What is the technical object behind this? That's my goal. So what I'm going to do is I'll just click on it. Okay. So, so we clicked on it. And again, there's lots of misconception that people say, oh, Fury is faster than the backend. Uh, well, that's completely wrong because the system is the same. The enhancement is the same. There cannot be anything. Actually, uh, the Fury should be a mirror image of what is in SAP, ideally. So if that is not the case, then it's wrong. Okay. So that's one thing that you want to make sure uh, it's clear. People can say a lot of things, but that doesn't really happen. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is first thing is you press F12 in your keyboard function f12 okay and then you'll see this thing comes up in the floor portion okay so here you can see in the portion it will show network okay here now what i'm going to do is probably i'll add some more entries here okay so let me see uh, this is spinning so now I see it's not uh, spinning. So let's see. Uh, okay, let's click on this again. So again, uh, it's based on the internet speed. It can be slow. It can be fast. For me, it's, it's a little slow compared to what is in the back end. Okay. So again, uh, so you click on this and now might say okay oh how so here if you see this is the place where you will see what is the o data service okay so you might see the o data service here is this one if so i just click on it copy the url or and now what i'm going to do is um, i go to this transaction code in sap slash i w f n d underscore main underscore service this is the old data maintenance and i double click on it and, and here it will open up and here i will try to find this service but now the service name is a little different than what i have copied so here the financial so you can see okay so let's see body this portion financial yeah let me search with this okay and sometimes there's z attached to it okay so here is this service so you see so it would be a z and then it will be so this is the technical object name and this is the external service behind it okay now this is very important because here when you click on it okay and here you can double click you can you execute in the gateway or you can call the browser so this is the place where you have all the code and all those things so this is pretty important and from here you can you can click on the service implementation. So suppose I click on service implementation. This will tell me all the all the stuffs that you want. Okay. And here, this is the standard. And if I go here, if I click on execute, I can go here and there is the get, post, put, whatever you can think of. Okay. And here you can click on service implementation. And here you see this is the this is the class okay where it's being used okay and if you double click on it you will have all the objects you can think of it 
that's what you want okay so and here you can put all the breakpoints and all those things you can you see all these things are there so so that's it so uh, that's it so it's very easy go to the pick up pick up the correct uh, uh, correct fury app and then hit f12 make some changes and then go to that iwfnd mint service and you get it from here so now the, i will show you another piece because not every app is like that so now what i'll show you i'll go to another app so i'll just hit the back button for now okay and uh, how can i close this i can just click on close and this will take me and now suppose i want to go to the um, front screen where i'll show you another app so again this 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 is slow as I, as you can see you know and uh, this is uh, as for hana and lots lots time they say oh it would be faster in fury and all those things well uh, not always okay so here what i'll show you is another one where you will have business partner okay and if i go scroll up so let me scroll up or i i can search here also but i'm not going to search because it's slow so let me see there are some nice out of the box wonderful apps okay so this is the one i want to click okay so i clicked on it don't move further so i clicked on it okay so it's click i clicked it so it's opening so again we'll do the same thing probably uh this is okay oops this is spinning oops uh, so probably i clicked a bunch of time more or another way you can do is always you can search here but since i think i clicked on it so many times it got mad so and we have a ton of app here so let me do another so probably it's a blessing in this guys i can use the search functionality now oops stop and oh it opens oh okay oh i probably clicked on something it did call center group so probably that's a, that's also fine we'll just try to put browse and let's see it's probably the continue and i click continue okay now here if i do the same thing function i'll i'll do the same thing f12 okay and here it may be a different uh back end stuff okay so what i can do is i can just select this i just want to select this and that will probably trigger something because this is a mandatory field that's why it's i have to click on it so again it's slow and then once it's it will give me the pop-up or the f4 okay uh, you can see how it is okay so let me select this click on this now you see now the the server it's a web GUI okay and if you see I click on this this will take me to a different transaction okay so here you can see uh, what I really care is about this one uh, he's on 800 yeah these are all web transactions so if you see these are web transaction that basically is not going to uh, it's going it's not creating uh, O data it's not created by O data but it's created by by a T code okay so it's a web so if you notice it it took me to this place uh, which is similar to a uh, transaction code now let me see what transaction code it is so let me put it in a notepad uh, let me put uh, let me put in 
in something let me put in a word document and, and i can click on a word document and we can select file everything is slow new and i click on it and here and here you can see all this and probably from here you can see there is some transaction code it's called but it cannot be figured it out from here okay so we came to know using this process that not every trans fury app will call the no data sometimes it's a web GUI uh, stuff what was this so web GUI it's saying web GUI and uh, let's take this out here uh, it's a web GUI yeah I see Mandy what's that I don't know so but um, yeah uh, so that's the way it is so it's very easy to an F12 and you know the the data service and from there you can go on and put your breakpoint and start your back. so that's it for this Fiori tutorial it's small uh, sorry it was a little slow but again it tells you that it's it will not be faster than the back okay that's it so stay tuned to my SP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.